I don't even have an hour today, girl. I don't have an hour today for Merit at First Sight, season nine, season 14, episode nine, is love on the table? No, it's not. I am wearing one of my new t-shirts. I'm over the fakery of it all. Okay, this is one of my fake Merit at First Sight shirts I had. I forgot I had it. And I was looking through my designs. I was like, oh, oh my God, let me get a shirt. So... Did y'all watch? You know I didn't watch, girl, because I was sleeping, okay? I am not investing not too much more time in Merit at First Sight. I'm just over it, girl. I'm just over it. I, I, you know, I said, let me go ahead and review this more, because if I didn't, it would have been next week, because my schedule is so full. I am still behind on Ready to Love. I don't know what happened last week, and of course, you know, I'm writing my books. And stuff. But anyways... I'm here for you, and it's 6.30, girl, so I don't, 6 four, so I don't even have an hour. I was trying to get down here at 6 o'clock, girl, but I was just dragging this much. I just, mm. And my window's open, girl, it's supposed to be raining today? Girl, I might just stay home. But I love you, I love you, I adore you. I am almost at my 17,000 cousins. Let me check my number. Be sure to subscribe, thumbs up. Um, thumbs up. Uh, thank you for your love and support. Thank you for those of you who have joined my Patreon. If you have not joined my Patreon, that's a way for you to show me love and support on a monthly basis. I talk to you one on one. I'm able to send your books out immediately as you, uh, as I get your address. So if you are a member over here, think about moving your uh, membership over to Patreon. Thank you for those of you who bought my books, left me uh, reviews. I love you guys. I appreciate it. Wow. 16,827. I love you. I adore you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's go, girl, because you know my time is short the moon. Is love on the table? No, it's not. Okay. Okay. Day 16 of marriage. Mm-hmm. Katine is at the supermarket, and she used to shop into her for herself, but now she got to shop for her husband. She know what she wants to eat. It's an adjustment. Hopefully, he's not on your bag. He, he's more. He's on more of your on your back. I'm fully submerged in marriage life for better, for worse. Mm. Oh, here go Noy cooking again. Noy, you cooking again? <clears throat> Ooh, uh, that's a lot of dogs. The drunk one. She looks drunk. I'm going to start calling her drunk. A.K.A. Um, AK, um, Lindsay. Girl, did you see how she acted last? It was so embarrassing. Love is the bond that love them to guess. Fake. Pastor Cal, fake pastor, P A S S A, not pastor, P A S T O R, pastor, fake pastor, pastor Cal, talk about all oh, their, their, the love is what bombed them together. Say, why, why is Michael walking like he's an old man? Girl, I just cannot. Who's that? Some pretty flowers. I love the butterfly. I love butterfly, yo. I got a lot of butterfly stuff. Look at Steve looking all handsome and chippery. <laughs> Hey, Dr. Pepper, I haven't seen you in a minute. Why is Lindsay looking like she's pregnant? That's a nice dress Lindsay has. Lindsay has some nice pieces, y'all. If you've paid attention to Liz, Lindsay um, clothes, she has some very, very, very nice pieces. I can tell you because I got nice pieces. <laughs> okay, so Steve say he woke up in his apartment. And Noy is gone, and she he wrote a letter to meet me at the park. I was like, "That's cute, that's cute. I like it, Noy. Okay, girl, you trying to make up for what you did last week?" Oh my God, I used to love that game when I was a child. You know, the find the next riddle and read it until you get to the prize. I love that game. Oh my god, that is so cute, Noy. Oh, he's putting flowers in her here. They're doing flashbacks. I love it. I love it. So 
Oh, she says she annoys. She approve. I know. Uh, um, appreciate Steve, and see where she can make uh, improvements. Oh my God, I love that noise. That's a brilliant idea. I love it. I, what is it, treasure hunt? Is that what they call it? This is one of the first photos we took together on our wedding day. Family tree. Tree. Oh, this is so cute. I love it. I love it. Which I can be found. All you have to do is turn around. Oh, that is so cute. I love it. Oh my God. I love it. Oh, I love it. How romantical. How romantical. <clears throat> So I say, if you love the narcissist, Alyssa, then I'm unsubscribing. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. I think they, they are cute. Noy and, and Steve should be working. By the way, by the way, by the way. By the way, by the way, by the way. I have a spoiler. I have some spoilers that I need to do. I just don't care to do them. I think I'm going to post them in my Patreon. I think I've already posted some in my Patreon. I did post this one in my Patreon. Yes, I did. So if you are in my Patreon, you already know that Noi and Steve were spotted together this week. Shh, don't tell nobody. I shouldn't have even told you because you're not in my Patreon. But anyways, I slipped up. But next time, I ain't going to tell you nothing. Mm, that's cute. I hope they work it out. I like Steve and Noy. Well, wait a minute, Steve. Where's the money? We still need to know what's going on with the money. Lord have mercy. The drunk and Mark. Uh uh. No, no, no. No, no, no. We don't need to talk about how is your day. Y'all need to begin the conversation from where we left off last week. How they gonna leave us hanging last week with her throwing stuff and cussing him out and telling her how tiny his balls are and stuff? And and now we talk about good morning. How was your day? No, 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 no. Uh, uh, uh. Back it up and tell us what happened. That's a nice dress you got on, drunk. She has on a nice, a nice dress. I have a dress like that. Oh, the drunk tongue. I'm so irritated. That's an ugly blouse you got on, Lindsay. You, I care about you. No, you don't, because you wouldn't have cussed them out like you did in front of everybody like that. That's embarrassing. Explosion. Explosion? Well, she said she exploded. She's sorry. I don't believe it. Excuse me. Oh, my God, Lindsay. Use the knife to cut the food and then switch the fork. I can't. Mark with all that salt. Mark. Is that his name, Mark? Ma oh, Mark. Mark, why do you need all that salt and you're already overweight? And all that black pepper. Look at it. I could cook a whole, I could cook 10 meals with the salt that Mark put on his food. That's his name, right? Why is that like, this is not his name, you know, because I, you know, I only make one video a week on Married at First Sight. Is he cutting the food with his left hand? No, come on, y'all. Don't know how to eat up there with your knife and fork. I can't. It's better if you just don't use a knife and fork. It's it's one of my pet peeves. If I went out with a guy that couldn't use a knife and fork, that was it. Bye. Bye. Lord, they just sitting there eating, nobody talking. No, this is ridiculous. They need to, they need to, they need to, from where we left, I need to know what happened. When you went home, what happened? Oh, okay, here go, Mark. Do you feel like you were out of line last night? 
Oh, well, she said we was having fun and you got negative. Ooh, ooh. Mm-mm. Ooh, when you gonna start giving me any affirmation? Oh, I love you and I kind of, I don't know how you love already, girl. It's too early to say you love. Oh, she said, I don't even know who you are. See, I wouldn't be feel comfortable in there with her. I would have to walk. And what if she cut you with a knife? Oh, she said she flipped her off switch on him. She said, I'm not trying to argue with you. She's a. Oh, she said Mark is negative. And you're always complaining. What is she said? When you gonna get weird? What I can't rewind, girl. She's crazy too. That's a big fridge. She said I need Mark to come to his his senses. Oh Lord, he's focused on how things are forgetting and for affecting him. What about me? Mm -mm. Well, she said she put herself second, Lindsay. Girl, what? Oh, she said Mark might be out of his league. Oh my God. Oh, I thought we had a moment last time where we were finally having fun. Ooh, she said, you're different on camera. He's like, stop with the camera stuff. Who are you? Ooh, Mark is going in. You said I hurt your face, but you'll say stuff that annoy me and you're not aware of it. Thank you, Mark. Tell him. Oh, Mark the shark. Right. Thank you for letting her know. She's she's unaware, girl. I had a friend like that. I had to stop talking to her. Oh, here she goes. I'm so frustrated. She said he's treating me poorly. Lindsay, Lindsay, Lindsay. I think I think Mark is right. Lindsay's playing for the game. I ain't Why should I act right? Somebody treat me poorly right now. It doesn't seem like he's what, Lindsay? Drunk. I can't wear her. Fast forward. I'm going to start fast forwarding through their part, except when she's fighting and cussing him out. And they, you know, I'm going to watch it. Listen, because I want to know what she's saying, because she's just crazy. But I'm tired. I just, you know what? This might be it for me. Here they go again, Lord. Here the Lindsay and Mark go. What do you like about me? Oh, she said, what do you like about me? It doesn't seem like there's anything. Oh, she said, it does seem like there's anything you like about me. She, he said, what you want to tell me? Tell her, Mike, I don't like you. You're an incredible love, loving person. Wait, wait a minute. She said, that's insulted. Wait a minute. Did she say when I'm inside of you? Wait. think you have an incredible loving person buried inside of you Lindsay the drunk she says that's insulting that's insulting go ahead mark tell her uh and he said i said this to you at the wedding and you said huh interesting I think it's hard to show. I think you have a tough exterior. Uh huh. So he said, You do a lot of nurturing things. You take care of the cats. You were there for my mom the first week, but. 
We have difficulty. Personalities, right. Right, right. She feels condescending tone. She is condescending. We like each other. We see good things each other. Communication skills. Right. Communication marks the communication has to improve for us to get to the next week. Oh, here she go. I have a lot less hold than I had before, girl. Just shut up, Lindsay. You talk too much. Oh, she's at one percent. And she said, "I don't want to give you the ninety-nine no more." I wish she could see herself. If we can get better, we can grow. If we can't understand each other, look at Lindsay looking at the camera. <laughs> I cannot, girl. Lindsay is too much for me. Ooh, I couldn't be able to be her friend. Mm -mm. I would have to go, sir. Bye. Okay, Jason, uh, Michael, and uh, uh, Jasmina. Oh, he set up a, a, a picnic for her, Jasmina, and Finney. So they could spend more time. I'm gonna get my... To let her know what? Why he looking like a pimp? Is it me or is Michael looking like a pimp in the outfit? Tell me the truth. Tell me the truth. Is it me or is he looking like a pimp? <laughs> she said it's gifts fruit. Feeding. It's honestly even better. She's happy to see he's doing things for the dog. She so says she didn't bring you nothing. Well, at least he has some time in the day to spend with her because you know usually he say I'm going at four and I'm coming home till eight. Oh no, what's her name? Have have uh, weaving her hair? I think I think her hair is thin. I think a lot of it is is her hair, but I can see the weave. Um, the weave bond. She'll probably add hair to her because her hair is thin. She looks like she has thin hair. <clears throat> oh my God. Fast forward with the dog. Let's get to the fight. Oh my God. They're still talking to the dog. Okay, here go. Is this the fight? Back on the honeymoon when y'all had issues, uh huh. How she feel he was talking? He was talking to her bad with a bad tongue. What's the best way to communicate to you? Okay, I see what y'all talking about with Jasmine. I, I didn't see it before. I see it now. Because he's on a picnic, <clears throat> Jasmina, and he's trying to be nice. And he's like, you know, I want to know what's the best way to communicate. And just the best way to communicate is to talk to me. Talk to me. You were the way you were talking to me. And I'm like, girl, you don't need to be like that. Not on a picnic. You know, this is a time for you to kind of take in a deep breath and breathe and just talk to the man. And she's over here having an attitude. Like, best to talk to me. Talk to me. The way he was talking to me. She don't, well, she don't like him no way. The best way to have a conversation like this, but her tone is still off, Jasmina. Your tone is still off, boo. She say you just need to talk to me. Oh, here he go. Never do that. Never do that. He's like, we both were speaking at a tone. Who she say you wouldn't have gotten that tone out of me if you didn't speak to me 
I see what y'all is saying, girl, about Jasmina, girl. She angry. Like, this is not this is not the time for that kind of tone, Jasmina. This is a time for you to be soft and speak in a soft, kind voice. Not don't do it, girl. Don't do it. Don't do it. It's basic knowledge and how to have a conversation. He's asking how should he communicate better, Jasmina. What's the problem with that? I can't with this show. I'm done with this. Oh, here she go. You don't have to have a basic conversation. The way I speak, I come to other people, maybe okay. Ooh, all you're saying is you're telling me to communicate. You, we're in the same spot. I'm telling you to tell me. She's like, calm down. Oh, he's about to fight. Fight, fight. He said, ooh, she said, don't tell me. He said, don't tell me to calm down. I'm just speaking passionately. You're getting annoyed, she said. Ooh, Lord. She said, okay, don't talk to me like that. I can't with her. I see. I see what y'all been saying. Because you're not trying to give people the benefit of a doubt. Oh, Lord. Right. Today was supposed to be a positive day. Made a left turn. A lot of communication issues. Oh, he's so short, girl. Do you see the camera panning over his head? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, Lord. Katina and Olupuvu. I can't with him. Who who in my comments say he's the next Ike Turner? So is she cooking every day or what? Oh, they were upset with each other from last night to this morning? You worry about things that don't affect me and I don't give a... Why do you do that? The, I, I asked you for it, can't do. You trouble me. Ooh! This... Mother Olu Poo Poo. This no good. Did y'all hear what he said? You trouble me as you trouble me. Little things I ask you to. This is the thing I don't understand. This is why I got to stop watching this show. Because this show is bringing, bringing the ghetto out of me. This. <laughs> you was just out hoeing last week. You wasn't being a husband. But you get married now and you you talking about she's not being a wife? Do you know what it means to be a husband? I just can't. I just cannot. I turn up. You're right. Who said it? I'm giving you credit for it. <clears throat> you was just being a hoe last week. But you 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 want you want you now all of a sudden you want this woman to be a wife and do all this stuff. And you know the definition of a wife. Do you know the definition of a husband, Olu Poo Poo? I can't with this nigret. I just cannot. I can't with him. He he trouble me. You talk about she trouble you? You trouble me. You trouble me. I pray to God, girl. I pray to God she don't stay with him. But you know the rumor is out that she stayed with the fool. You know the rumor is that she stayed with the fool. But anyway, Katina come off like she's a picnisha anyway. So I don't know if I feel bad for her. Because ain't no way some man going to talk to me like that. And I'm going to stay with his trifling behind. I don't think so. Talk about the stuff I asked you for, your king. What is your definition of a wife? She lucky, girl. It should have been me. I would have turned around and asked him. What is your definition of a husband? Mm 
doing, but you know what she's doing? She's trying to prove herself to the. Oh, child, let me. Maybe we had two different definitions. She should have said, what's your definition of a husband? She said, someone who's a partner, your partner, your support system. Uh-uh, he got up and, and closed the cupboard. She she left the cupboard open. And the piss pot got up and closed it over her head. Katina needs to ask, what is your definition of a husband? See, he is the type of man that will sit there and you're folding towels and he won't even attempt to help you because that's a why I could never. I could never. I have a book coming out. That's my next book that's coming out. I already got it back from the editor about the guys I dated and why I stopped dating them, girl. Bye. This nigrette, I would have never. You wanted me to cook more. You wanted me to cook more. Ooh, he feel like she wasn't cooking more. Cooking enough with her wife duties. Is it, it's more than, how, 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 y'all, I need to stop. How is this? I, I, this piece of crap, this piece, sorry excuse for a male was out here being a hoe. And all of a sudden, overnight, you want a wife. And she's not doing her wife duties. She's not acting like a wife. Mean like, what? Do you know what it means like to... You know what? I need to stop watching. I guarantee if I stop watching this show, my blood pressure is going to be normal. Because stuff like this upset me. I just can't. Mm. The end of that? Everybody was in. And then, and then. I say, hey, do you want to, like, let's clean up. Let's clean up. And you say, I only want to clean half the floor. Do you feel like her I only want to clean half the floor. Can you see your husband say, hey, let's clean? Please, please not roll your eyes because I'm, I'm Ooh, she's so basically at the end of the night, I mean, I'm going to bed. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm going to bed. So he's like, was not not cleaning. And then she rolled her eye. He said, please don't roll your eyes. See, I couldn't. I couldn't stay with this this piece of. Okay. Oh, she said, "I'm talking to you. I'm not talking at you." I couldn't stay with him, but I think she's a, she's. I think she's um. I think Katina is in a position where she just needs to have somebody for herself, and because there's no reason for her to stay with this piece of shit. Excuse the language, say she knows early in the morning. And I said, oh, you was cleaning the floor. Listen. You made a little Bible about it. So I said, you know what? You go to sleep. You make a little Bible about it. She said. Where is my other half? Where's my other half? Clean the floor. If you want to clean the floor, clean the damn floor. I want a wife. I want somebody to come to you home. Like, hey, my husband is stepping up. He wants to clean this together. And I'm not going to let him. Oh, please. He's, Katina, cuss him out, girl. Cuss him out. Who he said I came in here for a wife not to help somebody grow as an individual. He said I'm not your friend. Katina cussing him out, girl. Who he said I'm not your boyfriend. I have a and she's looking at him like I hear you, I do. When I envision my marriage, I did inspect obviously. Every man is going to want a wife that's going to do certain things. She wasn't expecting. Ooh, powerful. She said, I did not expect that I would not be meeting somebody else's standards. That's powerful, ladies. Because y'all need to know what his standards are, honey. Well, these are things for you talk about before I get married. But, you know, anyways, they got married at first sight, girl. So, you know what I always say. I mind my business. He said it bothers him. Girl. 
girl, no. I just, girl, I just, I will cuss his ass out. I will cuss him out. See, I will, I will, I will, I will cuss him out. Okay, that's why, see, that's why I had to marry who I marry. Okay. <laughs> See, that's 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 why I had to marry who I married. Okay, man. That you know, that's why I had to marry my husband. Okay. I I I, I couldn't marry no Olu Poo Poo. I would I would cuss him out, drag him. Okay. <laughs> I just couldn't do it. Hi, Jasmina looks real pretty in her orange dress. Okay, she's making dinner. Michael has a big old sound. Oh no, she bought the pool girl. <laughs> Look at Viviana. Okay, spoiler, spoiler about Viviana in the Patreon. Oh, Lord. Mark is cooking for Lindsay. That's a nice blue you have on. She asked, she, he asked, how you like your hamburgers? Okay, who's coming over? Okay, so the doorbell ring and it's topics for them to discuss. So they're lighting candles. Noi, what you sucking out the glass, Noi? What's that? <laughs> he looking at oh Steve, you need to go get your teeth whitened. Have you ever been in love before? Yes. But Noi's been in love with everybody. Have you? Um, yeah, I feel like I've been in love several times. Oh, she said he been in love several times. Yeah. <laughs> she said like how many times? Like oh, like, like 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 he said he's had five rela serious relationships. He's loved all of them. Oh, Noy say it's interesting because it's hesitant. He's been hesitant to have this. But Noy, you just met two weeks ago, Noy. You just met two weeks ago. Give him some time to fall in love. You know what my daddy said? Don't fall in love, girl. If you fall in, you can fall out, but you can grow. What do you think it takes? Well, she's already in love, Steve. You should even ask these questions. She's already in love. When things aren't funny, what? And how her partner show up for her in those moments. Mm -mm, child. <laughs> what, make, what makes me fall in love? Let's see. <laughs> you got to be tall enough. <laughs> the money's got to be right. <laughs> you got to be a credit born again. Your credit can't be messy. You need to have a good job. <laughs> you need to have decent savings. Your investments must be on point. You need to have not have 50 million kids. You need to be able to put me in a decent house. Okay. That's how that those are the things that make me fall in love. <laughs> those are the things that make me fall in love. Okay. Grow in love. That is it. Don't fall in love. Grow in love. Okay. Those are the things that causes me. To grow in love. Yes. He's smiling at her. Mike. Did you Mike? Did you hear me just now? Mike. Come here, Mike. Mike. The show that says, uh, what makes you fall in love? What made you fall in love with me, Mike? I was cute. <laughs> oh, Mike. My, huh? What made me fall in love with you? <laughs> Lord. Oh, he, he, Steve said he has to be comfortable. Yeah, yeah, you got to be comfortable. I think that I think they don't need to force each other to to be in love. You know what I mean? Just let it happen naturally. Once he feels that he's ready to see it, and see, betcha she's going to be pressuring him to feel it. Do you still feel like it's too soon? Oh, here she goes. Do you still feel like it's too soon? Yes, it's too soon. I think it's a good place to be there. I think we're 
He said, I think we're getting closer for sure. Oh, she said you, not me. She said, I say we, I'm including that. Oh my God, no, I leave the man alone. I feel like we're saying the same thing. We're coming along with, she needs to stop harassing him. Oh, no, but Noi falls in love with anything. You know, Noi, she will fall in love with a tree. So I just don't want to hear nothing about you falling in love, Noi, because you're desperate. You're a big mean shit. You're scared that he's, Noi, it's been only 19 days. Give him a chance. Right, it hasn't even been two weeks, two weeks, 14, okay, mm -hmm. two weeks. It's only been two weeks, girl. Give that man a chance. Oh, my God, girl. If he kisses, I can't wear her. She's a nut. We made a commitment to each other. She just want him to say, I love you. No, he has to feel it and be it and feel like he loves you. Just give it time. Right, right. Not because we're married means it's going to work. That's right. Tell her. Tell her, Steve. So Steve is mature. I like a mature man. <clears throat> right. Everything that happens between the... Go ahead, girl. What do you think it takes to fall? Okay, here we go. To the shit pot. That's what I'm going to call him. Shit pot. Okay. He talking about, what are you talking about? Devotion. devotion. Can you even spell devotion, shit pot? Can you even spell devotion? This, this is the thing that bothers me about this piece of crap. You was out here hoeing around being a hoe. And all of a sudden, you flip a switch. Why he didn't marry one of them girls he was hoeing around with? Now, I could understand if it's somebody who was waiting and looking to be married and really want to be married and doing right and being right and treating women right and not sleeping with a mother and daughter. I could understand. But you was just hoeing last week. You was just sleeping with a mother and a daughter last week. But this week, you want to be hard on Katina. Talk about she's not being a wife. She's not doing wife. How the hell you know what a wife is supposed to be, sir? When you was out here hoeing around. I don't understand. Make it make sense to me. <clears throat> Devotion, commitment. Katina is, she's, she's doing too much. Katina is too desperate. She says someone who supports her. Someone who's loyal and patient. So whoever she's with is, I want her to be the best friend. Yeah, best friend takes time to develop, Katina. <laughs> Why he looked like he was crying? His eyes are red. She want to focus on emotional connection. She don't want to end up hurt. I don't want to be so vulnerable that I end up feeling like. And she don't want to be so. Right. She don't want to be too vulnerable that she said that. Because see. Ola Pupu. Ola Pupu is a man, ladies. You can't trust him. Somebody like that. Somebody like Ola Pupu, the shit pot. You can't trust him. He's not a man that you can trust with you, with your heart, and expect for him to protect you. And that's that's a part of that's a part of loving someone. I know it was for me, you know, the way Mike treated me and how I felt like <clears throat> I was safe with him, like he protected me. You know, I remember one time we go, we went to the supermarket, and I think this is the first time he was making dinner for me or something. I think he had a couple of friends over. 
And he held my hand with his right hand and he had the basket in his left hand. And every time he got to something he wanted to pick up, he would put the basket down and use his left hand to pick up. He never let go of my hand. He We walked around the supermarket and he held my hand and he never let go of my hand until we got to the register. And I just remember that moment and I'm like, I like this. You know, he makes me feel safe and he makes me feel secure and he makes me feel protected. And those are the little things for me <clears throat> that made me say, okay, you know, I need to start looking at this guy a little bit more seriously, you know, because I felt safe. But like the ship up, I can't with him. He is somebody you can't really trust with you because he'll, 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 he'll Ike Turner you in a minute. And I just, you know, it's just sad that they, the rumor, the spoiler is that they stayed together and they're still together. They bought a house together because I just feel like Katina will never be really, really loved and adored the way a wife is supposed to be loved and adored. It's just sad for me. She, she said she's guarded. He said, because you don't cry. What or what are you doing for her to cry? Is he beating her? She used to cry a lot for her ex boyfriend. Why? Could, why Olu is Olu Poopa beating her? Is he beating her? Her ex boyfriend, what now? He was verbally abusive. Ooh, when she would cry, he would say, you weak BC. Why are you with him, girl? So ever since then, she don't cry. She trained herself not to cry. She's numb a little bit. And then she's numb, but then she got matched with this piece of shit. She got matched with this bum. Oh my God, I can't. Fast forward. <clears throat> oh, shut up. Let me fast forward. I can't stand him. Get off my TV. Get, get off my TV. Begin to fall in love. Okay. He said, I'll let you go first. She said, mm. I see the potential that I, you are someone that I can fall in love she with. She see the potential he's someone she can fall in love with. <laughs> no, no, that's not what I said. I said there is the potential that it could happen. It could happen. Why he look drunk? I don't understand women that date men like Olu Boo. <laughs> I just be like, <laughs> you know, women like Olu Boo type of guys. I just be looking at the girls like, girl, how you deal with somebody like that? What time is it? Okay. <clears throat> What's the question? He say, I like you. I definitely like you. Love is a strong word. That's true. Mm -hmm. I'm not. He's not gonna say it. So no, love is not on the table for me. That's not a bad thing. You're your own person. Oh my God. I don't fall in love easily. I don't know enough about my wife to say I love you, but you want her to be your wife. Shut up. Oh, well, wait, I forgot. He's never dated a black woman. So maybe you feel like a black woman is not deserving of your dusty, dusty bum type of love. Not saying he's a dusty. What well, would probably help if she expresses um, some more? Girl, please, bye. Um, and, you know, also, and he 
he's drunk. You see him? He's drunk as a kite. He's high. So what if one day she decides she don't want to clean and cook? You're not going to love her? Ooh, he said, I hope you take cooking, cleaning, and washing my drawers seriously. Because if you don't, I ain't going to love you. Girl, I will have to cuss him out. Ooh, I couldn't do with somebody like that. Oh, child, I just cannot, girl. What time is it? Okay. Do I have another 15 minutes? Okay, maybe. Okay. Okay, and back to Jasmina and Michael, and they're asking the question. He went to the cemetery, show his respect. That's a nice salad he's eating. Oh, that's a nice orange. It's just, hey, how was your day? Top. Type of conversations. So I love the fact that he just opened up to me. Oh, I love that dress. I love that dress. Yeah, I love the, 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 the hey, how are you? Yeah, I love, I love, I love those questions. I come home, Mike, my husband's working from home indefinitely. And I love, I love the, hey, Mike. Hey, honey, how was your day? You know, he said, well, how was your day? I love those are conversations you should have. Though I keep him up to date on the important things that's happening at the place, okay? <laughs> well, All Jasmine has been loved three times. <laughs> what about those relationships that made you feel you was in love? Oh, they made her feel good about herself. They had a friendship first. Oh, she knew it because she was so giddy. In my book, 23 Types of Guys, I talk about Mr. Best Friend. You know, a lot of you ladies want to meet a man and be, be his best friend and then expect the next step for him to marry. Girl, don't do it. I don't need no more best friends. His last relationship, he was in love. Oh, I love that he knew her. I knew her triggers. Ooh, child. Ooh, Michael. I love what he just said. I knew, he said, I knew her. I knew her triggers. You know, I knew how to touch her. <laughs> and it just goes from there. They make you think you can fall in love with everybody. I can't. You got to be the right man. Ah, to fall, for him to fall in love, he has to be vulnerable. It's not easy for him to be vulnerable. That's true. It's not easy for a lot of men to be vulnerable. He, he don't want to come off as weak, so being able to have that comfortability with somebody. That's, that's a good point he's making. Oh, she said propel me to fall in love. He asked, she asked, would you say you're falling in love? Oh, he said, I don't think we've had those conversations. So, well, what's stopping you from having a girl? Why are you asking the girl? He don't like you. You don't like him. This is new territory for him. It's like you're trying to force yourself to like this person, you know? Right, he has to make the decision for himself to be vulnerable forever. Sometimes it's hard for me to believe that maybe believe. certain things. He, 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 he doesn't mean he do lie. He's a lie. Why are you taking those seconds? Just, Jasmina, are you for real right now? Y'all's been battling from day one. So where's the love going to come in, girl? 
Where's the love going to come in if y'all been battling from day one? I don't understand it. Make you make sense to me, Jasmina? I don't, Lord. Here go the drunk. Drunk and Mark. Oh, are they? Is he eating curry? Ooh. What is he eating? She's eating a hamburger. What's those Mark is eating? She just that Lindsay look dry, look drunk and high every day. Every time I see her, she looks high. Oh, they had a breakthrough moment. You was able to communicate what? He wanted to talk to her because he knew that. Oh, he just eating like that, Mark. Slow down. Chew your food. He's trying to be optimistic about all she's trying to do is straight front. Mark got to slow down. No wonder he's he's a big dude. He need he eat too much. Oh my god, Mark. Slow down. <laughs> Oh, that was she was shacking up. You know, Lindsay's is shacking up tight. You know, those are women who don't love themselves. They know they their worth. That's an ugly cat. You see that cat that looks like <laughs> with the big tail? I can't. Right, Lindsay fall in. I want love. I'm loving love, and she's like, I'm learning. Love. Oh, he said, I don't know if I'll get there. How she'll be at that point? <sighs> okay. <laughs> I want to say what Mark is saying. Rejuvenate love. So. Oh, this is it. That's concerning to me. I would never go back to some. I, 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 I think I understand what Mark is. I think what Mark is saying is. You know, he's been in love before. This is my interpretation of all the, what I'm hearing, okay? So how he's going to know if he's in love is, does it feel familiar? I think that's what he's saying. Is that what you think he's saying? I'm, I'm just trying to interpret what he said because I couldn't understand what he was saying. But now when Lindsay responded, I said, okay, I think I got what he's saying. So it does, it, it, it feels familiar. I, I get it. I get it. I get it. Right, right. You realize that guy was great. Not... They had a lot of great stuff, but it wasn't the right person. Oh, she said, I wouldn't go back and recycle. But no, nah, I see what Mark is saying. I understand. If it didn't work, but I, 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 she's not understanding. Mark is talking about familiarity. Like it's familiar to me. So I know that's how I felt about that person. So this is how I'm going to know. Everybody has their different journey. She feel like for Mark to, to find love is after somebody pushes him away. Why does it take for you to fall? If it's not like it takes time building a foundation, that's Patience good. And Patience and time, that's okay. good. Getting to know the person, I agree. For me to fall, and they need to be present, Lindsay. You in love with everybody, Lindsay. Oh, excuse me. She wants somebody who is consistently present. Abandoned moment and shy from conflict. I just cannot with her. Mm 
And when she don't get it, she's checked out. So Mark is going to be like, okay, I'm going to ignore her so she can check out. Ah! Ah! He said, if I constantly think about with Lindsay, I, it's going to be a negative. That's true, Mark. He don't like her job. She crazy, honey. I don't think any man can stay with Lindsay. Lindsay's a nut. She's a full nut. I'm trying to stay in the prayer. Uh uh. No, I add everything up. The way she acted in the bathroom, cussing you all, call, calling your balls small. No. What's the possibility or not a possibility? It's just if you had asked me a week, two weeks ago, didn't you just get married two weeks ago, Lindsay? The last 11 days has been tough for her. Oh, she said, I'm definitely not there with you. It's not that I can't be there. Oh, she said, I need you to make time for me. So what? what? Oh, I can't. Lindsay is getting on my nerves. I'm ready to turn the TV on. Oh, I really haven't gotten any of that from you. Girl, I'm done with her. I'm done. What time? Is I got to go, girl. I got to go. I got to go. <laughs> Lindsay getting on my nerves. I love y'all. I'll try to finish the uh the second half, you know, whenever I, I have an extra hour to spare. But I love you. What y'all thought about what we've seen so far? I'm just tired of these people. And if y'all don't see me next week, then you know what happened. Be sure to subscribe, thumbs up. Thank you for your love and support. I really love and appreciate you. I adore you. Have a great day. Bye.